I think the team is very exciting. You know, they, uh, we've been preaching since day one, August 10th, when this group started out with so many new phases that it would take five to six weeks before I projected that this team would start, uh, start coming along as a team and start showing signs of their, their potential. And I think uh, especially the game at Stanford and especially last Sunday's game, I think it was important for the team to validate that they're on the right track. So I think now, you know, knowing that uh, Friday the real season starts, I mean, they're, they're very excited right now. It's very exciting. I mean, one of the things I talked to uh, Josh and Dan about is that uh, when I look at uh, the, the seven games that we've played so far, I think we've given 28, we were able to give 28 players playing time. You know, and if, I think it's unique really in, in, in our recent history for us to be able to get so many guys you know, involved in the game. And I think you know, through that, although you know, record-wise, I think we might have taken a couple of hits early in the season, I think we're able to build a lot more, uh, a lot more depth this year. I, I think it sounds like a cliche, but you know, especially with a young team like this, it's really about focusing on one game at a time. You know, Friday night, Gonzaga at home. I think our guys realize that the first game in conference at home is a very important game, and I think we're not really looking beyond Friday night. Um, and as, as I said. Uh, the team is ready, they're focused, and I think they're really uh, ready to have for a good showing Friday night.